Let's review what we've covered in this course. First, we discussed the strategy for solving a business problem and stressed the importance of understanding the problem, the analysis needed, the decisions that would be impacted by the analysis, and the data that is needed to support the analysis. In short, spending time up front to understand the problem and the data available will help ensure quality analysis. Second, we reviewed some of the non-predictive analysis techniques. And third, we reviewed a process to help you understand the different types of predictive models and use the methodology map to help determine which model is best suited for a particular business problem. Then we returned to our example business problem and followed the problem solving framework and the strategy for selecting a model while also learning about linear regression along the way. Congratulations, great work, and you're now ready to build your first predictive model.